Yo what's up guys, in this video we will check out some of the most expensive skins in CS2. Make sure to stick to the end because the price of the last skin of this video is crazy. We will talk about skins so I'll not include any capsules that are really rare. But before we continue, are you looking to upgrade your CS2 experience? Enter Skins Monkey, your go-to automated trading site. Instantly grab new skins, backed by 24-7 live chat support. Want more? If you trade enough skins, you will get $5 for completely free. Plus, they offer affordable skins and a whopping 30% deposit bonus and get 5% more for using my code REVIMP. They also cause free giveaways and simple tasks for skins. Don't miss out on this amazing trading site. Join them today by the link in my description. We will go over 10 skins that are really expensive right now and we will start with the AK-47 Gold Arabesque Souvenir and the price of the factory new one is almost $7,500. I can't lie, the skin is really amazing but do you think this skin is worth buying if you have the money? You can also buy a battle card for $1,700 but in my opinion the skin don't look that good when it's battle card. Now moving to the next skin, AK-47 Wild Lotus. The Wild Lotus is from the signed Mark collection and there are less than 3000 in total. This is probably one of my favorite AK-47 skins simply because the artwork of it is just amazing. If you are looking to buy the factory new one, Wild Lotus, the price of it is around $10,000. The M4A4 How was first introduced to CS2 9 years ago, on May 1st, 2014. It was released as part of the Hunt Begins update. This skin cannot be obtained by opening any containers. This skin is also not part of any collections. The price of the M4A4 How can really vary because the Star Trek Factory new one is almost $14,000, but you can also buy the well worn for just under $3,000. Also, the price can go up because most of the people using this this skin also applies some really expensive stickers. To buy some of the factory new crimson wet knives you should know that the price can go up to $30,000 but the pattern of these skins is very important and how the webs are placed. Even though most of the skins are very expensive you can buy the navaja knife, crimson web and that will cost you around $350 for a factory new one. Another really beautiful but also very expensive skin and that is the AWP Gunnier. This skin is pretty new and it was released in 2019 and the reason for the price to be so high is because there are only 3000 of these skins in circulation. Even the battle scarred version of this skin will cost you thousand dollars but for a factory new version it will cost you around ten thousand dollars. Now moving to the Emerald, Ruby and Sapphire skins, these are probably my favorite knife skins but they are really really pricey. I think one of the most expensive skins from the Emerald and Sapphire are the butterfly knives that cost around $20,000 and from the Ruby the most expensive skin is the Karambit that costs around $11,500. Now moving to the most expensive gloves and that are the Pandora's box. For the factory new ones the price is $56,000 but as you can see they look pretty fire in the game. The skin that probably everyone playing CS knows is the AK-47 Case Hardened Pattern 661. This skin is just iconic and the price here really depends on the pattern because the 661 pattern costs between forty dollars and $200,000. That a skin can cost $200,000. And the second most expensive skin in this video is the Souvenir AWP Dragon Lore. The most expensive is the Souvenir version which can go up to $150,000 if it's factory new. There are only 114 Souvenir AWP Dragon Lores in existence so that's why the skin is so expensive. And now moving to the most expensive skin in this video and that is the Karambit Case Hardened Blue Gem with the pattern 387. The price of this skin can go up to 2 million dollars. Also the owner of this skin turned down an offer of 1.5 million dollars. So yeah guys I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe for more content like this and see ya.